Why, hello everybody, Merry Christmas. My name is Santa, I mean Mechanic Dave. Um, I'm gonna show you a picture real quick. See this fucking engine? This is the 351 that came out of the OJ Bronco. Now this thing, this engine has been abused. It's been given so much rev limiter, it's unbelievable. It's done burnouts, it's been mudding, and then it took on water and made no oil pressure. The bearings in the lower end are completely blown out. But it's okay because I've got a fix and there's only one way to fix one shitty ass truck and that's with another shitty ass truck. All right, so on the left, the most left, you'll see the white Bronco. It's all torn apart, no engine, no trans. And then let's pan a little bit more. Ooh, 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 what's, what's that? Well, let's go take a look, a little gander now, shall we? This is a 1989 Ford Bronco. It's been modified a little bit as you can see the uh the size difference in the tires those are 31s that's sitting on pretty good tread these are 36s don't even worry about it look at that fucking rot junk but it's got all the good parts that i need this tailgate's just just done that's all bondo this whole area is just bondo wow yeah uh, nice top though. Uh, and it's got these, uh, these nice door mirrors. I really like those. I like those. So we're going to put those on. <coughs> what do we got inside here? Smells like musky. Oh, good fucking Lord. What? What the fuck is this shit? I can... Get rid of all that fucking junk ass headliner. <sighs> Hate that stuff. But anyways, as you can see in here, we've got so many fucking spare parts. There's another dash right there. Just everything. There's a computer for a, a 91 F-150 with a 302 automatic with overdrive. Uh... There's some boot liners back there. If anyone wants them, let me know. Still shuts mint. But the thing that made me buy this absolute garbage heap of a truck wasn't just the big tires. It's actually got a reverse mount leaf spring shackle kit. Hey, look at that. That might give you an idea what's in this fucking thing. Ugh. Ugh. Goodness. Kind of fucking. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna climb up. Just to undo this. Hold that. Oh. Oh, all right. Ready for this? This, my friends, is a 460 cubic inch big block Ford. Probably makes about 400-ish horsepower and all the torques. And it's gonna sound absolutely nasty with those long tubes. Very first big block. This was a small block. That was a small block. Everything I've played with up until this point has been a small block, but it's time to up our game, you know? It's time. Look at the size difference in, this, in these trucks too. Makes this one look like a fucking Focus. <laughs> These two trucks are gonna become one. That's right. Little Miss Problem Child with her blown up engine will be getting this lustrous engine. Have not heard it run yet, but it does run. I've seen a video of it running, but it does not currently run. I mean, look at that. There's the fucking solenoid just chilling there. You don't need that actually. And when you use um, wires as belts, 
on alternators, then that, that just means it's good. Hello? Is there anybody in there? No, okay. So let's go ahead and cover this turd back up because tomorrow, it says it's gonna snow. Oh, I done fucked it now. Well, we'll come back to that later. Let me tell you the plans for this truck, but let me get inside first. So yeah, I'm a little excited to get rid of a small block and obtain the big block. Now, this isn't gonna be just some drop it in, fucking let's go, join a joyride next week kind of deal. Nope, this is gonna be a project done right. In fact, I'm not gonna make any videos on it other than giving you updates. Uh, I feel you're not allowed to see this. Uh, this is classified. The mullet actually told me not to let you guys see uh, progress on this truck. So um, unless, of course, you follow me on Instagram, you won't be seeing that truck for a while. Um, but rest assured, when it is done, this is going to be one of the most badass Broncos out there, okay? Going from a small block stock suspension, stock tire size, just putting on an exhaust and mud tires and thinking, yeah, I got a, I got a woods rig and a half over here. Well, now we do kind of have that, uh, that big boy toy. So when that, when said big boy toy is all done, you will see it here, uh, but it won't be going to the usual mudding areas. It just won't be a challenge for it. We'll have to find, you know, like, driving across the entirety of the Everglades with the truck. It's about the only thing that would be interesting with it anymore. So, we never did an off-road test with the truck. There you go. We'll be going to one of the old places for an off-road test of the modified truck. So, oh, I didn't mention, it's a solid front axle too. It's a Dana 60, I think. So, this thing should be pretty fucking sweet and nearly unstoppable. Um, now, this being said, the plans for the Fox body had to get put on the back burner a little bit if we wanted this really nice truck. So, she'll still be a 5.0 for now, but I won't rest until I have 347 cubic inches of go fuck yourself under that hood. And... If we're quite honest, I'm not gonna stop mobbing until we get 460 cubic inches of go fuck yourself under the hood of that truck. So, I know this video's probably been pretty short, but um, yeah. That's that's the update on that. Um, Fox body, I guess I'm just going on the back burner for now. And as far as the focus, well, every day as I look out the window, I see those headlights staring back at me. And I think to myself, what would you look like as a boat? Hmm. One can wonder. All right, that's going to do it for this little small episode of Mechanic Cave. I just wanted to make a video to show you guys the truck. Sorry, I can't show it running or anything because it kind of doesn't. But, um, yeah. I'll catch you guys on the flippity flop. Adios. Fuck that sun glare is bullshit. Oh, and one more thing I think that Bronco will be receiving. I think we might need to dispense a little bit of freedom if you catch my drift. <laughs> oh, maybe we'll go drifting with it.